Okay, so you have a rim that you want to build a wheel with. You don't know what the effective rim diameter is. It's not that hard to figure out. All you need are a couple of kind of long spokes. In this case, I've got a pair of 294 millimeter straight pole spokes. You could do this with J-Bends also. All you would have to do is cut the head off of the J-Bend, leave the J-Bend, because you're going to need that to hook on a spoke hole. So, assuming that you're going to use straight poles, this is how it works. You take the first spoke, insert the head into a spoke hole, lay the rest of the spoke on a wood block. Pull the spoke towards the center until you feel the head of the spoke touching the inside of the rim. Now you're going to do the same thing with the second spoke in a spoke hole diametrically opposite the first one. So we're going to insert the spoke head, lay the rest of the spoke on the wood block, pull towards the center until you feel the spoke head touch the inside of the rim. Now you can see that the spokes overlap and we're going to measure that overlap. In this case the overlap is 35 millimeters. Now we're going to go to our calculator and we're going to enter our spoke length which is 294 millimeters. We're going to multiply that by 2 because we have two spokes and we get 588 millimeters. Now we're going to subtract the overlap which is 35 millimeters and the end result is 553 millimeters. That's your effective rim diameter. Now you're ready to build a wheel.